Hello, this is Kaletron Blaze, and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Galaxy. In the last episode, everyone, we checked out the kitchen, started some of the levels off in there, and yeah, had a lot of fun. And today's episode, we're going to be changing things up a little, and I'm just going to try and do a lot of jump cuts and explore as many levels as possible. So, if you'd like to turn to that, please make sure to leave a like on the video, and if you're actually new to the channel, then please make sure to subscribe. But let's get right into this. So now we have this really quick galaxy hurry scurry. Hoping we're going to, well, we're probably going to have to hurry and scurry about. And I think I can see the main challenge of the level right over there as Mario bashes his head into that coin block. Yeah, it looks like we're going to have to try and get all of these notes. So let's just run around as fast as Mario can and see if we can get every single one of these. The challenge, not looking too hard. I think we're pretty much done. And Mario can round this kind of corner to complete that level. And the stars right there, guys. All I have to do is drop down into the center of this planet, just like this, and we can ground pound to collect that. Very nice, Mario, and we can go ahead, move on to the next star. So here's our next galaxy we can try out. Looks like it's going to be all about rolling this ball. And okay, if you're thinking about just rolling that ball away, you'd better listen to old Billboard here. First jump to get on top of the ball. Okay, so we have Billboard, the Billboard giving us instructions. And oh, it's, it's motion controls, so that's... We need to hold the joy cons. Oh, this is going to be weird. Okay. That's what we call basic position. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tutorial, tutorial. I, I understand how we need to move now. So let's just get on with this level. Yeah, here we go. We can move. There we go, Mario. And oh, this is pretty cool. Like the music, the music speeds up and slows down depending on how fast Mario moves. So if I don't move at all, it's just it's very slow and quiet. But if I suddenly start moving, you just here it suddenly starts ramping up. I love that. And now Mario can make his way down here. Oh yeah, just rolling backwards on top of the ball. And now I think it's time. He just goes for a bit of a. We're not gonna. We're not interested in taking the danger routes. Let's just run as fast as we can on this ball. Defeat the Goon Bros. And here we are. Jump! No! Don't wanna die! We're not killing Mario here. Let's avoid. I know we need star bits, but we can avoid them for now. And now let's. Oh no! Oh! Goomba! Why? And we start from the beginning. That is, that is brilliant. Well, never mind. We are back here already. And all we can do now is not just run straight off into that gap after jumping on this Goomba. Just bounce on him. Then we can do a run and jump. Epic skills from Mario. And we can blast off. I think it's the end, yeah. Very nice. And we can just jump. Straight up to the top of the flagpole where the star is waiting for us. In a classic Mario fashion. Just gotta climb the ending goal and get your star. And there's Mario's second star of the day. I think now we also should have enough star bits to feed this hungry Luma. Yes indeed we do. So we can get ahead to feeding this little boy. Feeding him up until he's nice and chubby. Then he can transform into his own brand new galaxy. And there he goes. The Drip Drop Galaxy. Let's head right in. Okay, so we can arrive on some sort of entirely water planet with just some penguins around here. Let's talk to this old guy. What do you want? Ever since those big eels showed up, we haven't got any fish. Okay, so we just need to get rid of them. And I guess we can use Cooper shells. Well, let's go eel hunting. Immediately, we can just try and snipe some. Oh, yes, he's already gone. Let's dive down for this. Oh, my. Okay. Mario, you can do this. It's not that hard. Just get the, get the chest. Open it. What are you doing, Mario? Okay, so I was being stupid, you need a green, you need a shell to open up these chests, so 
Let's go and get that one up from that one and see if we can find any more treasures hidden away in these chests. Like this, what's in here? Ah, I'll never know. I'll just go and take out another eel if I can. Here we got an eel, let's see if we can stuck them like that. Nope. But we do have red shells. Maybe they can home in on... Okay, no. Yeah, so like I was saying, maybe these home in on the eels. Also, no, we need to get health, we need to get health. And we've just lost our red shell, but we've got another. So let's try homing in on these guys with the shells. And it does work. So let's just go back and find some more red shells, like this one here. And take out the last eel. Or die to the contents of a chest, you know, that's, that's always an option too, I guess. And I think this may be our last eel if I can swing around to get him. Is that the last one? Yes, it is. And Mario can be rewarded for his efforts with a star in a sunken pirate ship. And we can, oh no. We can get that if we avoid the spiky urchin. And there we have it. Star number three for the main man, Mario. Oh, it seems like we need to rescue Luigi in this one. Ghostly Galaxy. I'm sure a nice one for Mario, hoping he doesn't get hit by any of those ghostly ghouls. Yes. And we start off on this nice ship, which conveniently has just a launch star right beneath it, because why wouldn't it? Let's see, what can we destroy here? We've got Goombas, we've got Pillars, we've got an Invincibility Star. Oh, you gotta love that like classic Invincible Mario music. And now, he can just run along here, no fear, destroy this chain chump, and run inside the mansion. That is spectacular. And we could use this. Oh, if please, don't run out just yet. I could use this, no. I could have used, if I'd done it right, I could have used that invincibility to kill this ghost of the key in as well. That would have been cool. But as it stands, I guess we just have to get this guy into the light. There we are. And now we get our key. Mario, of course, being able to move into here. And now we've got some... Do you just get Goombas to take care of? Or... Oh no, I see we've got to collect star bits. Or star chips, rather. So, let's just try and... No. I will get you. There we go. we got one. One at least. And here's our final star chip. That gets us our nice star. And it looks like we're probably going to just burst out the roof, if I'm right. So, let's hop into this star. And... No, we don't. So maybe there's a secret or something in there. That's something to consider for maybe another playthrough. But probably not now. And now we've just got some weird kind of key to collect, but... Hello, Luigi. Don't worry, we're coming to save you. We are saving you soon. Do not worry. We'll be back soon. Anyway, let's just uh, grab that star. Oh, that was a risky maneuver. But we made it in safely. And now we just gotta dodge. Oh. Yeah, just run past the ghost. They won't do nothing. They won't do nothing. And cool. We got a ghost mushroom. We get to turn into Boo Mario. That's pretty epic. I would just walk past the light and phase through solid matter. And okay. This seems fairly simple in here. I think we just gotta raise up into this room. And then, ah oh no, we, we lost the Boom Mushroom, which I don't think, kind of sad, but we do have our bro waiting in here. What's he got for us? Bro, you finally came. I got lost with the toads. It was terrible, but I found a power star, so that makes up for it, right? You, you're in the middle of a ghost mansion and you just randomly have a star. How? Do, I'm starting to think these things just randomly appear everywhere, but yeah. Let's go home, Ouija. That is our fourth star, and it's one you get with your bro. Well, what she got for us now? Welcome back. I can see your brother from here. If you ask him, I bet he'll help you search for power stars. And I'm sure he has a lot to tell you. You should go speak to him over there by the garage. Yeah, sure thing, Rosa. Let's go ahead and do that. Hello, Ouija. What have you got for us today? Bro, you're looking for you're looking for power stars, right? Let me help. 
I think you've missed one in the good egg galaxy. If I find it, I'll write you a letter. Keep your eyes peeled for it. We'll do Weejube anyway. Let's head straight back to another star. Well, we have unlocked Bowser Jr.'s airship armada. Another boss level. So I think we should head right into that. And see what stars we can get. Hopefully just a massive grand star to restore the Comet Observatory. So it looks like this one is going to be very airship based. And I guess the only way to do this airship is to just rush through it as fast as possible until we find Bowser Jr. Hopefully taking him down and, you know, saving a grand star. Let's see, how can we do with this? Manage to land on the pole safely and we can just keep heading straight on. We got another cannon to aim at. We can go for the top of the flagpole once again and Okay, grab the pulsar because otherwise we were going to be going into the abyss. Hello, Mr. Luma. Luma Lee Luma Bop, can I sell you something for only 30 star bits? No, because I don't have that kind of money. Okay. Let's see, can I get star bits from these enemies though? Yes, I can. Sorry, Wigglers. I may need your star bits for some health. Would you mind giving it to me? Thank you very much. What's up here? We got how many star bits? 20. That's not enough. Hello, may I ask you how many star bits do you have? How many? Tell me. Is it 10? It's 3. Dang it. So now with one health, we head on to the, I guess, the airship onslaught. Can we get this one up? Yes, we can. That's very nice. Now we just have to avoid all the cannonballs. Definitely easier said than done. So now Mario's going into the black hole. No. Fortunately though, we do start right back here. So we can take on these wigglers. And buy ourselves a nice juicy uh, max mushroom, whatever it's called. Yes, I'd like to buy. I want the red one. Thank you very much. Yes, yeah, so you get your fill. And we get our mushroom, please. I want the mushroom already. Thank you very much. Let's go for this second time. Mario, you better not die at all. Get rid of that tarantula or not. And we almost got knocked off even though we had extra hearts. Yikes. Now we can head on to defeat Kamek here. Just spin him away. He's not too much of a worry. And we can head up here for whatever's next. Oh no. Is that little Bowser Jr.? You just don't give up. Fine then. I guess I'll just whoop you myself. You want this gun stuff so bad? You're gonna have to take it from me. Well, maybe Bowser Jr. That doesn't really sound like much of a threat. You're not really the most powerful enemy. And he's killing his own Koopas. Why would you do this? They're your soldiers. They're meant to work for you. And I completely screwed that one up. Let's fight one a bit higher. And three hits should probably do it. It's a Mario game. You don't really have more than three hits normally. But these bullet bills are closing in fast. Kinda just avoided me. And there we go. Three hits. Is that it? No! He's got a phase two. That's a bit unusual. Oh well I guess. And I yikes. Havoc. No. Don't. Bad. Bad turtle. And I guess we only got a few more. A few more hits to land on him. So let's do this quick. Oh, only two. I thought it was going to be three, but oh well. And now his starship just blows up. Hello, Grand Star. Nice to see you once again. And this is going to be our fourth Grand Star, I do believe. Or no, our fifth if you count the opening. I'm not sure. We just got Grand Stars. Well done, Mario. Now it's brilliant to see him taking it home to the Comet Observatory. What colour will that star go now? Maybe blue or something? Oh, a nice kind of turquoisey. Love that colour. And we got four grand stars. Yes, that's totally what I meant to say at the beginning. Thanks to you and your friends, all of the domes on the lower level are working again. 
Once the engine room on the upper level has power, the whole observatory will be working. Then the Comet Observatory will fly as a starship once again. And you'll be able to fly your special one into in the center of the universe. Very nice. You've left it from Luigi. Okay, well we can deal with that in the next video, guys, because I think I'm going to wrap it up just about here. We unlocked the bedroom and got a bunch of stars elsewhere, which I think is pretty nice. So, not to save it for now. We'll do that later, but yeah. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you have enjoyed this slightly different episode of Mario Galaxy, please make sure to leave a like on the video. And if you're out or new to the channel, then please make sure to subscribe. But thanks for watching, everyone. This has been Caleb Plays. I'll see you all in the next episode. Goodbye.